Welcome back, Classic Gamers, and thanks for viewing Jay the Classic Gamers. Let's play Mike Tyson's Punch-Out for the NES, one of my favorite NES games of all time. With that said, let's get started. Starring Little Mac and his trainer, Doc Lewis. Also playing the role of Mac, it's you! Guest stars, Glass Joe, Von Kaiser, King Hippo, Piston Honda, Great Tiger, Bald Bull, Mr. Sandman, Don Flamenco, Soda Popinski, Super Macho Man, and special guest Mike Tyson. This is a story of true victory, but the road is long. Mike is waiting for your challenge! <sighs> Holy shit, I'm out of breath. I don't know if I'll be able to do the commentary. <sighs> Let's keep it clean, now come out boxing. And now we will fight our first opponent, Glass Joe, and he is the easiest one by far. Bring it on, Glass Joe, I'm about to make you my bitch. Ugh, take that, you want some more? If you can time this punch just right, you can knock Joe down. And sometimes this is good for a KO. But apparently not this time, so we're gonna have to kick Joe's ass the old fashioned way. Nice, I got a star. It only takes one star punch to knock Joe down. Don't get up Joe, I'm just gonna kick your ass. Oh yeah, another star. Say nighty night, Joe. Great fighting. You won by TKO. You'll be ranked up to number two. Are you ready for the next challenge? And our next challenge is Von Kaiser. Von Kaiser shakes his head before he throws a punch. If you can time this just right and punch him in his stomach as he does this, you can sometimes get stars from him. Just like that. Now dodge his punch and knock him to the ground. Now Von Kaiser will come out throwing duck punches. Just punch him in the stomach and you'll usually get a star from it. Dodge his punch and let's knock him to the mat again. Repeat the process one more time, and Von Kaiser will be defeated. Great fighting! You won by TKO! You'll be ranked up to number one. Are you ready for the next challenge? Next is the WVBA Minor Circuit Title Bout! And the minor circuit champion is Piston Honda. I wouldn't say Piston Honda is difficult in any way, but he is your first real challenge. Piston Honda will move his eyebrows right before he punches. If you can time this just right, you can get stars from him. Come get you some, Piston Honda! You want some more? BAM! Take that! Oh, don't give me that fancy footwork. Take this! Uh! If I'm not mistaken, I believe that punch will knock him out sometimes. But not this time, so we're gonna have to knock him out the old-fashioned way. Oh, hell no! You didn't just punch me, did you? Well, at least I got a star out of it. 
Oh shit, he just took it away. What's up, Piston Honda? You want some more of this? You want some more? Oh! Watch out now, little Max got a star. And he knows how to use it. Oh! Give me your belt, Piston Honda. That's what I thought. Great fighting! You win by TKO! Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new champion! Now we get this nice little cutscene of Doc Lewis riding a bike and Little Mac jogging in a pink sweatsuit in New York City. I just think the cutscene goes on a little too long. And our next opponent is Don Flamenco. Don Flamenco is super easy. He will ag you on to punch him, then you dodge his punch and just alternate your punches until you knock him down. Take a seat, son! I'm warning you, Don, don't get up. It's not gonna be pretty. Now he will come out of the gate swinging, dodge his punch, and repeat the same process until you knock him down. And Don Flamingo is out like a light. Great fighting! You win by KO! You'll be ranked up to number three. Are you ready for the next challenge? And the next challenge is King Hippo. King Hippo is another pretty easy character to beat, but you gotta make sure that you punch him when he opens up his mouth, then punch him in the stomach. Once you knock him down once, he is out for good. Take that, fat so! You want some more? Open that mouth, yeah! Uh. Great fighting, you win by KO. You'll be ranked up to number two. Are you ready for the next challenge? And the next challenge is Great Tiger. Right before Great Tiger throws a punch, the gym in his head wrap will blink. So dodge his punch and then counter it. You're too slow for me. You want some of that? You want some more? I can do this all day, every day. Now Great Tiger will start throwing duck punches at you, so dodge his punch and then counter him. Or you can just punch him in the stomach and get a star from it. Booyah! Now Great Tiger comes out throwing more duck punches. Just dodge him or punch him in the stomach and get some stars. BAM! You want another one? BAM!
This asshole really wants some more. Really? And once again, he comes out throwing duck punches. Punch him in the stomach and grab you some stars. Don't be afraid to use them. Bam! Oh shit, he's using his tiger punch. Just hold down on the control pad and block it. After he does that, he gets dizzy. Punch him one time to knock him out. Great fighting! You won by TKO! You'll be ranked up to number one. Are you ready for the next challenge? Next is the WVBA Major Circuit Title Bow! And the champion is Bald Bull. Bald Bull is really the first opponent that may give me some fits. But he didn't give me any fits this time. You can't hit me, Bald Bull. I'm too fast for you. Uh, how's that feel? Oh, now you're trying to get sneaky with your hook shot. That ain't gonna work either. Uh. What? A duck shot? That ain't gonna work. Come on, you want some more of this? Uh. Now stay down until the count of five. Yeah, that's what I thought, bitch. More hook shots. Get out of town. What? More duck punches? Take that shit somewhere else. Now it's time for you to see the mat. And this time, don't get up until the count of four. That's what I thought, bitch. You're doing the same shit, Bald Bull. Haven't you figured it out? It's not working. Oh no, don't do the bull charge. Oh! Bam! Great fighting! You won by TKO! Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new champion! And once again, we get a nice cut scene of Doc Lewis riding his bike and Little Mac jogging in a pink sweatsuit. This time, it's at night in New York City. And once again, this cutscene goes on way too damn long. And the next opponent is Piston Honda again. We will have to face some of the guys we've already faced before, but when you fight them the second time around, they are a little bit harder. Piston Honda will still move his eyebrows before he throws a punch, so that's an indicator for you to get the hell out of the way. Uh-oh, duck punches. Take that! And that! This duck punch is kind of tricky. It will throw your timing off. Oh, you son of a bitch. You just hit me. Little Mac don't like to be hit. Take that! Sit your ass back down. Great fighting! You won by KO! You'll be ranked up to number 5. Are you ready for the next challenge? And the next challenge is Soda Popinski. A lot of people think Soda Popinski's hard. I really don't see where he's that hard. You bastard! Are you laughing at me? Now I'm gonna whoop that ass! Soda Popinski has a similar fighting style with Super Macho Man, which is an opponent that we'll see later on. The only thing that seems hard about Soda Popinski is that I cannot beat him in the first round. Hope you have a nice flight! 
You were making a big mistake by getting back up. When Soda Popinski gets back up, he starts throwing the same shit at you, so he's not very tricky. You laughed at the wrong person. Nighty night! Now what we want to do, since we cannot beat him in the first round, is to get his energy as low as we can starting the second round. Aw, oh, hell no, he didn't just hit me, did he? Stick and move! Stick and move! I'm gonna make you feel punch strong. Oh, hell no! You're really laughing at me again after I whooped that ass the first round? And now I'm gonna whoop your ass this round! Badow! Get your ass up so I can knock you back down, bitch! Your duck punches haven't worked on me yet, so what makes you think they're going to start working now? Keep throwing them lame duck punches. See what's going to happen. It's going to keep on ending like this. Now who's laughing, bitch? You want some more of this? Come on! Uh. Take that! And this! Yeah! Great fighting! You won by TKO! You'll be ranked up to number 4! Are you ready for the next challenge? And the next challenge is Punk Ass Bald Bull again! This bald bull is a little bit different. The only way you can knock him down is to punch him in the stomach when he does a bull charge or use a star punch to knock him down. Other than that, there is no big difference between this bald bull and the first one. Good thing he gives me free stars. Didn't you learn the first fight, bald bull? Your hook punches and your duck punches do not work on me. Wait for it, wait for it, BAM! This time, Bald Bull, I don't want you to get up until the count of nine. Ah. That's what I thought, bitch. Alright, I'll punch you for a star. Then I'm gonna knock you down with that star. Another free star? Okay, I'll take it. Oh shit, the bull charge. BAM! Since I still have two star punches, this last knockout should be pretty easy. Holy shit, three stars now. He's really going down. BAM! You want another one? Oh, take that! Great fighting! You won by TKO! You'll be ranked up to number 3. Are you ready for the next challenge? And our next challenge is Don Flamenco again. There is only one difference fighting Don Flamenco this time. He's a lot harder to knock down. Don Flamingo will do something different this time. He will come out of the gate swinging. Unlike last time.
but just like last time, I will still make him my bitch. Get a clue, Don. Your stupid shit's not gonna work. This is the part where Don tries to egg you on. Once you punch him, he will swing at you. And we can knock his ass down. Get your ass up, I'm not finished with you yet. At this point, since it's so late in round one, we really don't want to knock him down again. All we want to do is lower his health so he'll have little to begin with in the next round. I would say that's low enough health. Dancing like a fly, bite like a mosquito. The Flamingo Thanks Back, Return of Dawn. Unlike round one, Don Flamingo will start agging you on right off the bat, and we can knock his ass down. Oh, you're coming back for some more? Come get you some. What he's trying to do when he ags you on, he's trying to wear you out. But that shit don't work on me. Take this. Bam! Get your ass up. I'm not finished with you yet. Well, come on, punk. Swing at me. There you go. Uh-oh, this is the first time in the game where I'm tired. And to become untired, you have to dodge a couple punches. Booyah! I love how he wobbles before he falls down. That's funny. Great fighting! You won my TKO! You'll be ranked up to number two! Are you ready for the next challenge? And our next challenge is Mr. Sandman. Mr. Sandman, in my opinion, is the hardest opponent besides Mike Tyson. I don't know what it is about Mr. Sandman that makes him so hard for me. It might be his awkward timing. Watch out for these punches right off the bat. They are very fast. Oh no, he didn't. He just punched me. Oh, I better get used to it because he's going to be doing it a lot in this fight. There he goes again. Holy shit, he hit me twice in a row. Now he's switching to hooks and hitting me with them. That son of a bitch. There we go. It looks like I got into a little rhythm. Oh no, wait for it. Move! 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 Hit him! Hit him! Arr. Knock his ass down! Sandman is also another opponent that I cannot beat in the first round. So basically at this point, I just want to survive the round and damage Sandman as low as I can to begin the second round. But that's going to be a lot easier said than done. So far, so good. I thought for sure he was about to use his special move there. Dancing like a fly, bite like a mosquito! I think you're going to have a nightmare tonight. Alright, now let's try to knock his ass out in round two. Booyah! 
That's one knockdown, just two more to go. Mr. Sandman must be really pissed. He came out with this special move right off the bat. I was trying really hard to get through this match without being knocked down one time. But unfortunately that didn't happen. Now I'm really pissed. I'm gonna whoop his ass. Damn, special move already? Take a nap. One more knockdown and this fight is over. Let me take a wild guess. Special move. How'd I guess right? You want some more of this Sandman? Come on, bring it on! Bam! Great fighting! You won by TKO! You'll be ranked up to number one. Are you ready for the next challenge? Next is the WVBA World Circuit Title Match! And the champion is Super Macho Man. Oh yeah! Super Macho Man fights a lot like Soda Pop Inski, except for Super Macho Man has a spin attack. Super Macho Man, in my opinion, is probably the third hardest fighter behind Sandman and Mike Tyson himself. Your duck punches don't work on me. Give it up. I said give it up, chump. You really want some more of this? BAM! Watch out, here comes the spinning punch! Dodge, 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 dodge! Punch, 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 punch! I can't believe he hit me with the duck punch! This is what you get for hitting me with a duck punch. Uh-oh, watch out, here comes another quick spin punch. Aw, oh, damn it, he hit me! Booyah! Super Macho Man is another opponent I cannot beat in the first round. So let's just get his health meter down as low as we can. Oh shit, here comes another spin punch. I'm tired, Doc. Hang in there, man. Oh, yeah. My super spin punch is totally tough. Oh, yeah. All right, since I couldn't beat him in the first round, let's kick his ass in the second round. Take your ass whooping like a man, son. Bam. That's one knockdown, just two more to go. I knew it, he was gonna come right out of the gate with the spinning punch, but that shit don't work on me. Watch out, here comes another spinning punch. But like I said earlier, that shit don't work on me. Nighty night time! That's two knockdowns, just one more to go. 
and hopefully I can beat him without getting knocked down. Ugh, I guess the spinning punch does work on me, sometimes. Ooh, now I'm really pissed. I'm gonna whoop your ass, Super Macho Man. Oh yeah! Come on, you want some more? Give me your spin punch. Yeah, take that! In that! Ooh! Great fighting, you won by TKO. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new champion! New champ! The WVBA World Circuit. Last night we found a small but great champ. His name is Little Mac. The Dream Fight! Ladies and gentlemen, Kid Dynamite Mike Tyson! And finally we have reached the last opponent, Mike Tyson himself. The key to beating Mike Tyson, in my opinion, is just to survive the first minute and a half of the first round. The punches Mike throws in the first minute and a half will knock you down with one hit. So I would highly recommend that you do not get hit in the first minute and a half. Ooh, I hate when he delays a punch like this. It just throws off your timing. Alright, all I gotta do is survive 30 more seconds. Can I do it? Oh no, here comes one of his delayed super uppercuts. Oh shit, he tricked me! The timing of these punches are kind of awkward too, but he winks right before he throws them. Boom shakalaka, take that Tyson! Tyson is another one of those opponents I cannot beat in the first round. Hell, I don't know if I've ever beat him in the second round. I really can't remember, it's been too long ago. Oh great, here comes his winking punches. One thing that makes Mike so hard is that you're only allowed to punch him a couple times. Alright, looks like I'm going to survive the first round without getting knocked down. Dancing like a fly, bite like a mosquito! You think your speed finger can match the streak through my fist? Alright, we survived the horror that was round one. Now let's see how good we can do in round two. Oh, you son of a bitch! Where'd them straight punches come from? He is kicking my ass with them straight punches. Now it looks like he's going back to using super uppercuts and wink punches. Boom shakalaka, down goes Tyson! At this point, I don't think we're going to beat him in round two. But I can at least try to get his health down as low as I can for the beginning of round three. Watch out for this move, the only thing I do is block it. Even though it makes you tired, all you gotta do is dodge a couple punches and you're back to normal. Oh shit, it's another delayed super uppercut. Time to block again. You will notice I hold back at the end of this round. I don't want to take his health down any farther. Dancing like a fly, bite like a mosquito. Y your experience doesn't match mine. Go home and practice. And we have survived rounds one and two. Let's see if we can knock Mike out in round three. Well, I do know one thing. This first knockdown is not going to take very long. Boom shakalaka! Oh, 
Oh, whatever, Mike. Get your ass back up. You're not fooling me. You might notice in round three, I'm getting a lot more punches in on Mike. I don't know why this is. Maybe because Mike's tired, or the developers just wanted to make it easier to knock out Mike in the third round. That tricky straight punch, you son of a bitch. Now I'm definitely going to knock you out this round. Boom shakalaka! That's two knockdowns, just one more to go, and we beat Mike Tyson. Damn, he's relentless with them super uppercuts. Just a couple more punches and he should be knocked out. Oh no! Block! Block! Uh, oh no, I'm tired! Dodge! Punch him! Knock him out! And that is how you beat Mike Tyson's punch out for the NES. Great fighting! You are tough, Mac! I've never seen such finger speed before! Glass Joe! Von Kaiser! Piston Honda! Don Flamenco! King Hippo! Great Tiger! Bald Bull! Soda Popinski! Mr. Sandman! Super Macho Man! So this concludes Jay the Classic Gamers. Let's play Mike Tyson's Punch-Out for the NES. I hope you've enjoyed it. I want to thank you again for watching, and thanks for the support.